The Election Commission has accused the Congress of fabricating vote, a voters list and submitting it to the Supreme Court to get favorable orders. The poll panel told the Supreme Court that Congress petitioners must be punished for fabricating the voters list. The Congress rebutted it, saying that whatever was available in the public domain was submitted to the Supreme Court and that the same list was carried by electronic channels. In an interesting twist today, the poll panel today accused Congress of fabricating evidence in the voters list and trying to get favorable orders from the Supreme Court. The Supreme Court was hearing petitions uh, filed by Congress leaders Kamal Nath and Rajesh Pilot on the Rajasthan and Madhya Pradesh election. They wanted a free and fair poll. They also had argued saying that huge lakhs of bogus voters are there in the voters list which had to be cleaned. And secondly, they said uh, lakhs of voters also have disappeared from the voters list. Today, the uh, Election Commission's lawyer told the court saying that uh, the petition submitted in the court which had the details of the photographs and saying that these are all uh, uh, dubious or bogus voters. An Election Commission checked with his data bank with the photographs and said these are completely photographs which is not there, it is, these have been fabricated and he said the uh, Commission doesn't know where they got the list and said for this they will have to be punished. Uh, he went on to say seven years jail term is for this offence. But immediately Kapil Sibyl, appearing for the Congress, rebutted saying that this voters list already in the public domain and some electronic channels have already carried it. This is nothing new and in fact he said the CDs of this voters list had been handed over to the Chief Election Commissioner, Mr. O.P. Rawat, when the Congress team met with a sort of grievances. But Election Commission denied it. But the two judge bench told the Election Commission saying that they will have to check with the CEC and come back to the court on Monday. So Monday we will have to wait and see what happens in this case.